we start this video, I must explain my uploading schedule for a little bit. You see, school ends next week, and while I only have to go back for an exam in a uh, regent, I ha I'm going to be working soon, and I will be working until Labor Day, so videos might still be uploaded on Friday, Saturday, Sunday, depending on, like, you know, other things. And, since summer break is almost here, I can finally set up the TV show reviews again, because I put them on hold for a while, because... Like, I didn't have time to do a marathon, so, um, if I have time, a Sequest review will be coming up soon, and I think the other Sequest show called Sequest, uh, give me a minute, Sequest 20, 2032, which is a show no one knows, and hopefully, once I review those, I can review the easier shows, and then get back to the hard shows, like Alice in Borderland, which I haven't watched yet, which I really should. And then talk about Walker, even though I only watched the pilot. And then review shows I have seen, like Touch and Destiny Survivor. And then go back to shows I haven't seen yet, like 24 and My Ducks Game Changers, which just ended, by the way. So, yeah. With all that out of the way, let's review today's movie. Billy Elliot. In the year 2000, and also recorded live on musical for 2014, Billy Elliot is a musical by an 11-year-old boy named Billy who wants to do ballet, but obviously he can't do ballet because no one wants him to do ballet, because everyone's an asshole. It stars Jamie Bell and Julie Walters, who are like very two famous actors. And if you're wondering uh, who Jamie Bell is, you know Jamie Bell. Uh, like, I get it, you would know Julie Walters, but you, I'm telling you, you know Jamie Bell. Why am I saying this? Because, like, you do know him. He was Tintin in the Tintin movie, which was a really, really good movie. And if you ever had to watch Defiance for, like, a film class or a history class, that was him. He was, a, he was the brother. He was one of the brothers. So, you know Jamie Bell. Just, just expressing that out there. He was uh, also in the King Kong reboot in 2005. I don't know who he played. I don't actually care, to be honest. So, uh... Let's keep going. To me, I feel like this is the first time a musical, I mean, a movie became a musical because Billy Elliot, the movie, has no singing. Well, Billy Elliot, the musical that was recorded, has like a lot of singing and dancing. And this does have like dancing, you know? This is obviously like a dancing movie. And um, fun fact, Tom Holland was in this musical uh, as dancer and then eventually as Billy. There is no footage of him in the show, but there's audio of him in the show. There's some pictures over here, as you can see. My boy. This is why he's a good Spider-Man. He dances so well. Ooh, ooh, ooh. Not only is the movie really good, but the concept is so good for the year it was made. I mean, I don't know what it was like back in the 2000s. I mean, I was only born in 2004, so things were, like, just starting to get cool, but... The fact of a boy dancing is kind of awesome to me, and now it's like, you know, grown into this whole thing where, like, Broadway dancers and actors, like, all go around dancing and stuff. So, uh, I just think it's, like, you know, really cool. And, uh, yeah, that was Billy Elliot. 